There are many different ways an instructor can leave feedback for you on quizzes, anything in the question and answer format. So if you're looking to find feedback from an instructor, whether it's a graded quiz or not, the first place that you should start is the quizzes link right from the green navigation bar at the top of your screen. I'm going to scroll all the way down at the bottom because I set up a quiz to show us some stuff about feedback. So down here, I have a quiz that doesn't appear in the gradebook, but my instructor has looked at and wants me to see some feedback. Over here in the second column from the right, it says that my instructor has left feedback. Now, it says red because I had to test this out before making the video. If you haven't looked at the feedback, this link right here will obviously say unread. So let's click on this, and let's understand that once we get into this view, there are two places where an instructor can leave feedback for you. It's not very common for me to use this place to leave feedback. I usually don't. This is feedback for what's called your completion summary, and so this allows me to summarize all of the comments that I might have um, among all of your attempts. Now, for this ungraded practice practical, that is true. I did use this section down here, and that's where you'll see the comments that say, hey, you do this, and all of them, you don't do this here. As you can see in this little table up here, your individual attempts are listed. And one of my attempts has a little call-out icon right here that says, you have feedback for this attempt. I think that call-out message is pretty direct in what it's communicating. So in order to look at the feedback that my instructor might have left that's specific to this attempt of the practice practical, I would click on attempt one, and any attempt feedback would appear right here. And this is where I commonly leave feedback for many of our quizzes. I usually leave it here. I say, hey, you did a great job. Next time we do an assignment like this, try this. So um, I want you to be aware that there's feedback in both of those places for all of your classes, not just mine. So if you have an instructor who doesn't realize that there are like and I'm totally serious, like eight different places to leave feedback, um, make sure that you know the eight different places <laughs> to leave feedback and where to find it, right? The comments section down here, or you can look in your individual attempts.